Welcome to the All Plan Quick Start Lesson 1. In this brief lesson, we will introduce the user interface. All Plan starts with the welcome dialog. Here, you can start a new project, open an existing project, or copy a project. For quick access, the most recent projects will be listed here. Below you will find useful tips and explanations about new functions and direct connections to the All Plan communication platforms, All Plan Connect, Exchange, and BIM Plus. You will also find your All Plan version and your customer and workplace numbers along the bottom. For now, we'll close the dialog box to introduce the interface. A little tip, you can always access the welcome dialog here. There are two ways to access the commands in All Plan. The first is the ribbon along the top of the screen, and the second is the context menu by right-clicking on an existing object. We will work with both throughout the Quick Start lessons. In the All Plan user interface, you will first notice the ribbon at the top of the screen. In All Plan, this is also called the action bar. The ribbon is intuitive and easy to navigate. The ribbon is organized in three layers. First, select a role from the left side drop-down menu. The commands in the ribbon will change depending on this role. Within a role, the commands are broken down into tasks grouped within these tabs at the top and into task areas which are the groupings within each tab. The task areas denoted by a gray title bar are common to all roles and tabs. These permanent or fixed groups will always be displayed. The blue title bars indicate a unique group to the selected role and tab. You can determine the position of the fixed and unique areas. To do this, from the quick access bar, open Customize User Interface. Here you can decide whether the fixed groups are displayed on the right or left. Double-clicking the left mouse key on the subtitle of an area will expand or collapse it. You can expand all task areas by holding control on your keyboard while double-clicking on any subtitle. All Plan will remember the settings you made until the next change. You have the ability to completely customize the ribbon. These configurations can be saved and shared as needed. To do this, go to the Properties to open the Action Bar Configurator. Here you can customize your ribbon from scratch, or start with one of the built-in templates to modify as needed. Another important part of the All Plan user interface is made up by the palettes. These are a series of tabs located on the left side of the screen. You can click through them by selecting the specific title, such as Properties, Wizards, etc. Palettes make it easy to review, modify, save, and create objects in your project. For example, the Properties palette shows you properties of the elements you've selected in the model. You can then make changes to these properties. The same is true for any text in the model. Selecting it allows you to change the text, font, size, etc. We encourage you to explore the different palettes on your own. One practical tip. To save space on the screen, you can hide the palettes here. You will still be able to see them on the left edge of the screen, but they'll now be in the space-saving form of a bar. Simply place your cursor over the bar to expand the palettes. You can permanently dock the palettes for quick and easy access. Finally, a note about the All Plan title bar. Here you will find functions for file management, such as saving, importing, and exporting, but also the back and repeat functions, the convenient All Plan window control, and the All Plan options. On the right side are the All Plan help, a shortcut table, and some other useful functions. This completes the brief overview of the All Plan user interface. In the next lesson, we'll cover the All Plan building structure where you can easily manage the model, views, sections, and reports.